Welcome to this tutorial series, Getting Ready to Learn Python, the Mac Edition. This series of tutorials is focused on getting from the very first time, perhaps you even touch a keyboard, to writing your first program in Python. For the rest of the series, go to e2eml.school slash 111. This one will focus on files and directories. We start with files and directories because they're the nuts and the bolts that this machine is built out of that we're going to have to work with to write Python code. A directory is a folder, it's a box, it holds things. That can be pictures or videos or songs, or documents, even programs or apps. All of these things are files. And it can also hold other directories which hold other files. There's a really convenient program on the Mac for looking at files and moving them around. It's called a finder. You can get to it by double clicking on any directory if you see one on the desktop, or you can come up here to this little magnifying glass and click on it and just type in finder and it'll pop up a finder window for you as well. You can also find the finder icon almost always down on the little Mac toolbar and get to it there. And this lets you start browsing through directories and files and looking around. The finder is convenient for moving files too. You can click on one and hold that finger down and pull it over from one directory to another if you need to move it around. There are a few different views of the files in a directory that can be helpful depending on what you want to see about them, what you're trying to do. So you can imagine that you have a big closet it's got a bunch of boxes in it. Each box has smaller boxes inside of it. Each of those boxes might have smaller boxes inside of it. And you get down to the bottom and you find little knickknacks and pieces of paper. These are the individual files. The boxes are the directories. And if you take a step back, this whole closet is your computer. On the Mac, this is the whole collection of all the directories that you have access to. This will help us because Writing Python code is just creating new files that has special instructions in it that are specifically in the language of Python. So our finder will help us be able to see where these programs are and what directories they live in. 